Hey everybody, everybody it's Klein Lee, Lee, and today we're doing a Stranger Things My Little Pony review video. Yep, these ponies just got released today, and it's really hard to find. You can only, and there's only two per Target store, or at least what they have told us. And there's only, you're only allowed one per person, or is it two per person? I don't remember, but I don't think it matters. They're pretty exclusive, <laughs> there's not a lot of them around, and they're very limited. So we are very surprised and happy that we're able to get these. Before we get to this review, if you guys want to see how I made this demo dog or demo pony, um, please go down in the description. I'll have a link for that. We'll also have a card that's provided the video happening right about now. Yep, I'd be greatly appreciated because I just created him a few days ago. But anyways, yeah, thank a huge thanks to our mom because she got these for us. She woke up at eight in the morning to actually, go get the ponies. They may not even be out in stores right now because my mom had to go and ask them, and they had to go check in the back. And yeah, they just came into stock yeah, today. So they're very limited. So here's the pony in the box. This is the old, older kind of generation of ponies. So I know a lot of you newer fans may not like the way it looks, but I think it's kind of cool because um, it's set in back in Stranger Things time. Uh, so it's cool how that's these are the kind from, of this is like would back from the 80s. So yeah, this is. so that's really cool. So up here it just says you know Netflix Stranger Things and My Little Pony, and this is Applejack, and I think it's so cool how they have her upside down in the box, and the apples are actually the right side well when it's upside down, and this is the back of the box. Here are the side. Just as a comparison, this is like what the traditional Applejack looks like. It's very orange and colorful and like pinkish almost. Uh, but this one's like very monotone dull. They really wanted to make it look like, you know, the you know, almost like the upside down, how things are almost like colorless. So, yeah. These are the comparisons of the regular Applejack and the Stranger Things upside down version. So here's the pony taken out of the box. And actually, we bought a third one from a different store. And the box was already kind of dented and broken. Yeah, this is the one that had the dented box. Yeah, we're, sh we're not sure why this, they didn't even give it for a lower price and the box was wrecked. And it has the usual same hard to open boxes. Yep. Uh, this just has some tape. So we got it out of the box. Here's actually has a really soft texture compared to like traditional. Oh, wow, that actually is yeah. soft. It looks too, a bit shiny though. A little shinier than usual, but that's pretty soft. Are the eyes, do they traditionally have pupils or no? Because her eyes looked really glossed over, almost no. like how... Here, I'll stick this Oh, one yeah, back. I thought that looked a little bit interesting. And guess what? It has no freckles either, I noticed. Yeah, so her eyes almost have like that glossy look, that the like... look, and it has the same kind of brush, which is kind of cool. So it's the same kind of brush. And so basically they come with a brush and she has a bow on her tail, which is kind of cute. And there's oh. the apples that are upside down. And they yeah. were right side up when she was upside down. I like how they have key marks on both sides. I wish they did that um, for the for the, for the new gen. one. Yeah. Which I wonder if they will be doing that for Gen Five. I'm not sure. Yeah, we saw some concept drawings of Gen Five, and they look really good. So. So yeah, this is the close up of her her tail. Should we take it out of the rubber band, or should we keep it in? Or actually, we'll take it out just to see how uh, nice it looks. The tail again is really soft, like you said. The fur is really nice. Her hair, I guess. <laughs> really soft and also the head moves which I didn't think they did oh they would actually move they kind of look creepy yeah you can't really move it without this it looking weird creepy. <laughs> can you like turn it 360 oh my gosh you can yep that'd be weird if it came in the box like that <laughs> yeah but no I think it's yeah it's it's an interesting take I'm surprised that stranger things is like you know uh, endorsing or not endorsing but like you know promoting through my little pony yeah they also um, like paired up with what was it uh, Baskin Robbins, Baskin -Robbins and, and some, like, some other burger place yeah. or something, which is kind of cool. I mean, it's kind of cool too because I mean, I guess you know, just as Lee said, like these were around in the '80s. It's so. funny how the um, one I think it's going to be one of the sisters that have My Little Ponies. I think. Oh, but, um, like yeah. you know, like Lucas's sister. Yeah, 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 I think yeah. her. And uh, so that that's probably going to be really cool. I wonder if she'll have, have an Applejack. Apple yeah. And then I wonder if they'll show like the upside down and if the pony's going to be there. That'd be like, interesting. I think have, that'd like, be cool. We'd have like a prop from the show. Yeah. If not, th that'd be kind of disappointing. But this does look cool. And uh, um, I, mean, I forgot how much how much was it at the store? I really it was don't only remember. like eight or ten dollars. Really? It's it not less that than bad. $10. I mean, compared to some My Little Pony, you know, and recent gens you buy. And people are selling this for way more on eBay. Yeah. Than online. So if you have like a Target near your house, we'd suggest going there yeah. as soon as possible by because the time, yeah, by the time this video is posted, they should be out. And they because they, they came out today. They're very limited though. At least yeah. From our Target store, they said that they only got like one to two in their entire yeah. store. 
So we were just very lucky of getting this. And so. also other stores, like not all stores get them at the same time. So like, you know, whenever this comes out, you know, don't feel discouraged from going out and looking. You might as well give it a shot. And also if, if you don't see them on the shelves, be, be sure to ask an employee to see if they can check the system. Yeah, your Target may actually have, have it, it in the back. No, I don't know if this is the only, I don't know if Target's the only store that sells these Isn't or not. It? I don't know. because I thought It doesn't say Target exclusive, but I'm pretty sure it's the only place, but I don't know for yeah, sure. Yeah, because Toys R Us isn't around anymore. But yeah, we're super excited for Stranger Things, and I thought it'd be really cool. I also have this Demogorgon pony, or Demodog pony, that I created. So if you're a Stranger Things fan, please check that out. Also, as we were looking at this close up, we noticed there is some, like, a dirt stain. Or I don't know if you can see that, it's like yellow, brown, and we don't know why. There's, there's some, like, discoloration we're around. We're just gonna show some flaws of it, because we were looking at it closely. There's, like, a little gray speck there. And then also on the hoof, there's, like, a... Like, it's like actually it's like a pimple. Yeah, it's like a pimple or a mole. So I don't know what that's from. Especially that blotch of dirty That stuff. seems to be the most noticeable. Like, we don't know what that's from or if it's just a defect. But yeah, so... It could have been something that happened during, it, like, when it was in the factory this, or something. Well, this is the one that had a dented box, so I don't know if anyone took it out, but... But yeah, just some, like, things just to notice. Hopefully you guys don't get any with flaws like that. But, uh, overall this is good, but I don't know what that came from. So overall, I kind of like it. Actually. I think it's really cool. I think it's a really cool addition to like this, you know, like compared to some of the merchandise that they've sold, I think this is really cool how they combined like something that came from that time to it having a Stranger Things twist. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan on these these older kind of like it, generation, but I do think it, it is so cool to own something like you said, it's back in from the 80s. Things, yeah. And it makes you think like, oh, that's so cool. It's like a collector's yeah. item. I, I do really like yeah. this. So it's really, really unique. For only being around $10, it's definitely worth the money, especially since these ponies are actually bigger than, you know, the traditional It's gen hilarious how ponies. they've gone from this to this. Yeah. So. And then to whatever this is. Whoops, there's a price. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, why have the generations have changed? Just be sure to check around at all your stores, you know, make sure to ask around and see if they can, you know, don't be afraid to ask an employee to check the system because that's what we did and they actually yeah. found them in and, the back. Uh, we were not sponsored, we just bought these no, with we, our own yeah, money. No, yeah, we bought them with our own money and it, they're really cool. So yeah, let us know in the comment section what you think about these new Stranger also, Things Also tell ponies. us if you guys see any of these in stores because Around us, they, they only sell like one to two for the entire store. So yeah. If there's tons by you guys, you guys are so lucky. And they also made it seem like like not every store is going to get them. It depends on it their depends sales. depends how they're, yeah, so Yeah, so parties. like these are, you know, they're really limited. Yep, and yeah, tell us if you guys think you want to get this or... And are you guys, do you guys watch Stranger Things? Like, is that something you're excited to see? Because it's coming out July 4th. And that's yes, gonna we be cannot a... wait. And also stay tuned because we're going to be doing a... Uh, Stranger Themes thing video for uh, hopefully. hopefully well hopefully we were planning on doing it so you know uh, it should be coming out around the same time as this video if we do do it so yep so thank you guys so much for watching and, and we'll see you guys in the next video yep bye bye all right bye bye.